that would come in. Stetson's got a nice team. Uh, they played tough. They played physical. And I thought their guards played well. So um, we needed to come in from the beginning, expect a grind game all the way to the stretch. And that's what we got. So I was uh, happy. Uh, wanted to play some guys a little more than I was able to tonight. But uh, we stuck with those guys that were playing well down the stretch, giving us what we needed uh, to get a victory. Yeah, uh, well, I don't know where he gets mentally fatigued. He may be mentally fatigued, but um, but obviously, uh, you know, the first half, I thought we'd come out and uh, we were wanting it to be easy, uh, you know, to be able to pass it a few times and throw it in the post because the first two games, that's how it's been uh, because of level of competition. Tonight, you played a, an, another level of competition, so we we need to learn to work for it. You know, Justin and and uh, Stefan, those guys, they got to work in the post, and uh, it's not going to be there on the first pass. We got to keep moving the ball and get movement uh, to be able to get the ball inside, and uh, they got to make adjustments. So that will be a good lesson. Uh, I thought we were tight early on, as expected. Those freshmen, even though we play some exhibition games, it's the real thing. So I thought they played a little tight, took some quick shots early on, and uh, and that gave them an opportunity to get out. Uh, we didn't do a great job boxing out early on. Uh, I thought we were. Uh, disrespecting them with our ability to try to block everything and come down the lane and put us in position to give up offensive rebounds. So there's a lot of those things we'll learn from. Uh, we didn't get back there in the second half a few times for transition, uh, which takes the gas out of you when you come down, don't score, and give up an easy bucket on the other end. So uh, there's a lot of those little things that, you know, hey, we'll continue to grow in. Those are things we can change, and, uh, and we'll get better at. What's your substitute uh, early end off the uh -huh. game? <coughs> Which sure. Guys, which lineups are going to work match the best? Uh, just talk about a little bit more on some of the things that you saw from the lineups throughout the game. Yeah. Well, you know, play Shahid Davis, and uh, you know, Shahid. We're just trying to find a spot to put him because he brings so much to us. Uh, he's athletic. He's six foot nine. As you can see, he had 13 rebounds in the game, and um, you know we put him at the four spot. You know I thought Casey come out and got two quick fouls, and and you know here he had to set the first half, and and just trying to get back in the flow in the second half. It's not that Casey really did anything wrong. It's just that uh, there wasn't things really happening. So Shahid needed an opportunity to play. So uh, we we were mixing, matching lineups, trying to figure out uh, who to play, and uh, and I was just basing it on effort, uh, basing it on production, and uh, guys were doing the things we were asking them to do. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. And while we're trying to figure out who our go-to guy is on this team, and and obviously, uh, you know, he's got the ability to score. Um, you know, sometimes you got to live with some tough shots that he took probably early on. But when a guy can score like that, you got to live with that. Uh, but I think he made some big plays, made some big free throws. Um, he's just got that ability and that knack to either get fouled or score sometimes. And uh, you know, this is a great experience for him. He played a lot of minutes tonight, more than I probably like to play him. Uh, just because of the fatigue standpoint. But you can see he's not your typical freshman. He's, he's pretty tough and poised, especially down the stretch. There's 20 points off three first tonight. Such a close game. Talk mm -hmm. about how important it is to execute the little things. Mm-hmm. So important. We shot a lot of free throws over the last over the last week, and um, and I think it's important to make sure you got the right guys at the free throw line. And uh, our guys did a great job down the stretch making those. And uh, you know, some nights you got to win. Uh, it's not pretty. There's no ugly wins. I learned that a long time ago. And you know, we're not where we need to be at this point, or should we want to be? Uh, we it's still a long season. And um, but I was just really happy uh, that we were able to shut them down defensively more than anything down the stretch. Mm -hmm. No, they didn't. Uh, if they would have been here earlier, I would have. But uh, those guys got here. We had Keith Clanton here tonight, Marcus Jordan, A.J. Romsa. You know, all three of those guys uh, called. It's good to have those guys back uh, here. Uh, they came in the locker room meeting our guys. So, you know, obviously that's what we like. We like our players coming back to be around our team. And, and we had three of our signees here tonight as well. Uh, which was great. They were in the locker room cheering everybody on. So uh, that's the great thing about having those kids here with us as well. Sure. Um, defensive stops down the stretch. Absolutely. Uh, is that going to be a huge key? Obviously, the team, even if you can't, if you struggle offensively, to still be preaching the defense, team defense, to be able to hold on to wins? No, absolutely. I mean, you look at it more than anything. We held them to 30. 
34, 35 percent. Even though we didn't shoot well tonight, we still had a chance to win the game, and we did uh, because defensively we gave ourselves a chance. So, um, you know, I wanted to press more, but I had to play guys too long. Uh, that first group had to play too many minutes. So we were looking to press maybe to start the second half, but we could never get in the flow, I felt, to do that uh, with the way they were matching up with us. So we just had to grind it out in the half court and uh, find a way to win. Sure. I agree with that. Yeah, absolutely. I thought Stephon Blair made some big plays, big rebounds. Uh, you know, he was playing against undersized guys. They went small at the end, and uh, he made a big block, got a big rebound, made free throws. I thought he did some really huge things uh, in, in an important moment. So, but yeah, it was nice to, to win with defense and, and to win with making free throws. Those are two things that, you know, you win a lot of games with those two things. Absolutely. Well, I hope eventually it's Casey Wilson. You know, Casey's been here the most, and uh, you know he's just got to get himself in the flow. Still got great confidence in Casey, and we need Casey to be good, and he can be. He had his best week of practice I felt this week, and and unfortunately, he you know he couldn't get himself going here tonight. Not because he wasn't trying. I don't believe that. Just had one of those games he couldn't get in the flow, but he will. And uh, we need him to be productive along with him and Shahid. And, and obviously, we need Daquan and Matt. You know, Matt Williams has only practiced five days, you know, in the last four weeks. So, you know, he still can't get in the flow. It's hard to leave him out there long because his, his rhythm's still off with what he's been fighting. And, uh, and you know, and obviously, Daquan's a veteran. We, you know, we still need to be able to play him, and he will play for us. One more Was this one of the better steps in the that we've seen? Yeah. Yeah, I thought they did a great job. You know, I thought uh, Corey did a good job getting his team ready. And, you know, they played on Friday, which is a good, huge advantage for them. And they've already had a game. So uh, I think coming in, uh, you know, it's always been a big rivalry. And uh, here at UCF, probably one of the biggest ones for many years. And uh, so you can't underestimate when you play those kind of teams coming in here with your first game with a lot of new faces. And, uh, you know, they play tough. And, uh, you know, if they play like this tonight against other teams, they're going to win some games this year. Thank you. Thank you all. Appreciate it.